what's up guys welcome or welcome back to my channel if you're new here my name is stephanie i am a stay-at-home mom of two feeding a family of four i'm just gonna jump right into this and tell you guys that i'm gonna just be hauling what our grocery shop was like this week so i primarily shop at aldi i do do instacart either pickup or a delivery i usually do delivery if i have a lot going on but i do prefer the pickup because it is a lot less expensive to go and pick it up versus spending the extra like 30 some odd dollars to go and get it delivered here i've never really done like a legit grocery haul before but i kind of want to jump into doing that just because i think it's cool just to share the kind of stuff that we get as a family of four and i think it's cool also to share the type of things that you can get from different stores and i know aldi is like definitely been much bigger as far as people shopping there and stuff so i just want to show you guys typically what we get on a week-to-week -week basis it does kind of vary from week to week depending on the type of things that we need if we need more produce more snacks more meats more stuff like that it, it, it really just varies and depends on what the week is looking like and the things that we need to restock in i'm just going to jump right into it and show you guys what we got this week so the first thing i am going to tell you guys is the total of everything we got so there was a total of 45 items and my total came to 151 dollars and 24 cents that is typically what we spend a week as a family of four so just to give you kind of an idea, this is everything we got here. I don't really have it laid out as nicely and aesthetically pleasing as I would like to, but this is what I'm working with. So I'm just gonna bring you guys in closer and show you. I do just wanna note too that my kids are here and awake and everything. I have a one and a half year old and almost four year old. So if you hear them in the background, that's just what goes on. That's just mom life. So I can't really shut that off. Okay, I'm just gonna go in order of how I have everything kind of lined up and stacked on top of each other here. So. I have one bag of spinach, which was $1.65. I have a whole bag of golden potatoes, and that bag was $5.05. I have here a bag of four Roma potatoes, kidding tomatoes. That was $1.35. Then I just get a pack of the four sticks of sweet cream salted butter, and that was 275 underneath there i have just a pack of strawberries that was 235 a pound then i got these simply nature organic fruit snacks we were running low so i got some more of those my kids love those they are four dollars and nine cents 32 ounce carton of organic chicken broth that runs at a dollar 85 for that so then i have a carton of organic eggs 12 of them and that runs at three dollars and nine cents for that i got a box of blueberry muffins for the boys it's like four muffins in each pack there's five packs in there and that runs at a dollar 99 for that box then I get the Benton's, which is just like the Aldi cookie brand of the duplex sandwich cream cookies. My youngest loves, 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 loves these. And if I'm being honest, so does my husband and I. They're really, really good. But these run for $1.39 for this big pack. I got a 15 ounce container of ricotta, ricotta cheese. That was $1.75. I got a bunch of bananas and the bananas run at 55 cents a pound. And I paid a dollar forty. I had two point seven pounds of those. Next, I have this bag of brown rice and quinoa ziti for the ziti that actually I need the ricotta for, and that is um, a sixteen ounce bag. That was three dollars and twenty five cents. The little guys in here are gonna hear him rustling through all my stuff. <laughs> Then I got a bag of the oats, honey and almonds, granola, whole grain granola. I love this granola, it's so good. That was $2.45. These have become a family favorite. The cinnamon raisin mini bagels, the Love and Fresh brand. And this is $2.85 for this bag. I got two cans of the eight ounce tomato sauces. This is the biggest they have in tomato sauce cans, which I still don't understand why, but that's just what it is. They run at 29 cents a piece. So I paid 58 cents for two of those. I have one can of Simply Nature organic black beans and those are 99, <laughs> sorry. That's happening behind me. <laughs> These are 99 cents a can. Then I just got a can of the whole kernel sweet corn. If you could focus here, thank you. That is 55 cents. And then a can of cut green beans. This is also 55 cents. Okay, then I have this box of Texas toast, garlic toast for one of our dinners this week. 
That is $1.65 a box. I stock up whenever we run low on a plethora of these organic fruit and vegetable pouches. They have a bunch of different flavors. They have ones without vegetables. It's like fruit and yogurt and stuff, but I literally have a ton of them. They run at 89 cents a pouch, which is so good for organic brand. If you guys know, like Happy Tot and all those other ones are really expensive. These are 89 cents for each of them. And my oldest actually really loves these. So I stock up on those whenever Yay. I can. Okay, moving on. I got some frozen veggies, the steamable broccoli florets. I got two bags of those. Those run at $1.90 a bag. And then a bag of the California medley. And this is $1.05 a bag. I don't know why it's such a significant difference in price, but apparently it is. I got a tub of vanilla bean turkey hill ice cream that was three dollars and 29 cents definitely one of the more expensive items but it's name brand and this is just really good ice cream so okay next up for some meat i got a pack of the uncured all beef franks these this is three dollars and 19 cents for that i got a pack of premium sliced hardwood smoked bacon this bacon is so good like so so good i don't know what it is about it but it's very good four dollars and 29 cents for that i got some 93 percent lean ground turkey a pound of that went for four dollars and 29 cents then i got a pack of boneless skinless chicken breasts these are two or three i can't tell if that's two or three in there but they're huge um that was seven dollars and 40 cents for that then i just got some original french toast sticks the kids do prefer the cinnamon ones but i guess they were out of them because they switched out for this one still very good um this is two dollars and 15 cents and then we also got a box of just the home style frozen waffles. My husband eats these. Um, Maverick likes them too. $1.35. A half gallon of unsweetened vanilla almond milk at $1.99. A jug of grape juice. This is Maverick's every morning drink at $2.09. I got a 12 pack of Arizona green tea cans. That was $4.29. Two cases of 24 bottles of purified water and that was i forget three dollars and thirty cents so a dollar sixty five a case and then i ventured into the miscellaneous <laughs> aisle uh virtual aisle and i got one of these febreze unstoppable car fresh things i thought there was two in here so i'm a little upset there's only one but that was three dollars and ninety seven cents i'm honestly kicking myself in the butt for that because that's ridiculous and only for one that's crazy. Okay. Well, we're never doing that again. But anyway, I got that. Um, another thing I saw on there was this like sweater skirt. And I remember wearing these as a kid. And they're coming back in style. And I love that. I did get a large. I think it's probably going to be a little big. But we'll see. I don't know. It has the drawstring on it. I'm usually a medium. But I just would rather get a, a size up and see where it goes from there. But we'll see how I like that. The material seems really nice. So, And this was $4.99. So super inexpensive why not then i saw they had these armor all cleaning wipes for the inside of your car which i actually wanted to put a clorox thing in my car and i keep forgetting to so i figured i'd just get it while i saw it and that was three dollars 97 cents i usually get the downy defy beads but i'm not going to target anytime yet and i need them like now so um they had these arm and hammer clean sensation and wash booster things very similar that was $3.97 as well. And then for my last couple items here, and more miscellaneous stuff, $7 for this welcome mat. Huntington Home is their like home brand. I love their stuff. Um, it says, honey, I'm home with some bees and like a tree. This is actually not the pattern that I chose, but I guess they probably were out of it and he just um, gave me an alternative one. But the one that I have that we got as soon as we moved in here is like really dingy and worn out and stuff. So I just thought, seven bucks that's super inexpensive so i went ahead and got it if you guys don't shop aldi you might not know that like you could literally buy a house full of groceries and then also leave with like a leaf blower and like random stuff that's like useful um and they had this step two water table for only 30 dollars. guys water tables are not cheap so this was i thought was a really good price for that um we have one but it broke in the move so it's just like literally just holds water and does nothing else like it used to and it broke so i saw this one it looks really cute and fun with the little cups and stuff and only for 30 bucks and it's got like fun things on it like the water falling and stuff and we definitely uh we had to upgrade the one we had because it's broken so so that is it like i said that total came to 151 dollars, and that includes the two dollar pickup fee so technically 149 some odd dollars for all of those items 45 items definitely not bad i love shopping aldi 
Um, and like I said, this is just the kind of stuff we need this week. So not a lot, not a lot of produce, a lot of not a lot of snacks, that kind of stuff. We did obviously use all like needed meat and um, some things like that. And I'm always a sucker in getting roped into shopping the miscellaneous stuff because I can't help myself. I actually there are baskets. If you have not seen all these baskets, like go to Aldi's and see what kind of baskets they have because they all the time have such cute ones. And I wanted to get a couple and I didn't. I was like, no, we good. But anyway that is it for this haul i hope you guys enjoyed if you did make sure to give this video a thumbs up subscribe if you are new i do plan on doing this more often if you are into hauls you can look forward to that i'll be doing them more often so i hope to see you all in my next one thanks for watching bye